All right, guys, so in this video, I'm going to go through how to actually sign up for Uber Eats delivery walking, guys. You can actually deliver on foot on Uber Eats, guys. Actually, really, really easy, simple. So first, let's look at the requirements, okay? It's very simple, but it may vary by location. So basically, you just need to be 18 years old and have a valid government-issued photo ID. Literally that simple, guys. These two requirements, okay? So you must be a legal citizen and have a valid government issued ID and of age of at least 18 years. So what you need to do is when you're actually signing up, right? You want to select the delivery with bicycle or foot option under the choose how you want to earn the Uber. So you just want to provide your name, social security number, and your date, to, date of birth on the Uber app. And you just, you know, you're going to have to upload your government ID and profile photo, make sure it's valid. And basically what's going to happen is Uber is going to perform a background check from their end. Usually this thing takes like three to five business days. Okay. Business days does not include things like Sundays or public holidays. Okay. So these are business days. If you apply on like a Friday, uh, so Saturday is one business day and then Sunday is not counted. Maybe Monday is a public holiday. So you might get accepted like Thursday. And these are done by third party providers. And then just what it does is Uber just reviews the report to determine if you're eligible, eligible. So, so some valid forms of photo ID they, they you can use your driver's license, your state ID card, city ID card, or any other government issued ID, make sure everything is clear guys. When you're taking a photo, make sure everything is very visible, the text and everything and all the edges are visible. You don't want to crop in the image or take an image where it's too close. Make sure the whole document is showing. If it's the card, make sure the whole card is visible on the photo and the thing is not actually expired. And you want to make sure you submit an original photo of the document. You cannot just scan it in like black and white or anything. And once you're basically accepted, you'll get an email letting you know and you're all set guys to accept the review. It's literally that easy and simple guys. So if this video helps, make sure you hit that like button. If you still need any more help, you can comment down below and we'll help you out. And until next time, guys, make sure you subscribe.